Welcome back to Press On Mobile Coffee. My name is Anthony. Some of you know me as Gerard. Today we're going to walk you through our daily routine and setup. Since we don't have a permanent location, we store our trailer at home. So I built an RV gate for easy access. For faster setup time when I arrive to my location where I'll be vending, I like to brew my coffee at home and put it in my air pots, that way it's ready to go right when I open my serving window. Before I even leave my house, I like to turn the propane gas on for the trailer. Then I head inside the trailer and turn on the espresso machine so it can warm up. After turning on the propane, I then turn on my battery and electrical system. Since all my equipment will be heated up, once I get to the event, set up as a breeze. All I have to do is pull out my cups, hang my menu, pull out my syrups, and that's pretty much it. With this machine, you hold in the gas flow button for 20 seconds before releasing. And then open the steam wand valves all the way on both wands. And that takes about 30 minutes for the machine to heat up the proper temperature. Uh, once it does heat up the proper temperature, steam will start to come out of the wands and then you can close both of the steam wand valves. everything by himself because I have the kids um, so we're gonna go check on him I always go out and say hi also I will not pass up a chance at getting myself the most excellent cup of coffee so How goes it? Huh? How goes it? It's going. I make my drink I was trying to make 20 minutes ago. <laughs> Nature of the beast. Someone's at the window. Oh, thanks. Hello. Hi. Uh, can we get a hot chocolate for my little yeah, tiny? Yeah, you got it. Just the kids. It's not too hot. You're bad. Do you mind being on YouTube? Nah. <laughs> cool. <laughs> You can see yourself. Um, what's our channel name? Just press on copy. Yeah. Yeah. Simple. <laughs> yep. Hey there. 
Hi there. How are you? Good. How are you? Doing well, thank you. Do you guys have sugar free? I do. I have sugar free uh, hazelnut, vanilla, or caramel. Awesome. Can I do a sugar free, just a small uh, 12, 12 or 16 ounce? Yeah. Um, Caramel latte. Caramel latte? Got it. This is a hot chocolate. It's uh, 225. Do you want a hot chocolate taste? Yeah. And then a My Americano is amazing, by the oh, way. Oh, excellent. Good to hear. Hot chocolate for you? Yeah, hot chocolate for me. <laughs> Thank you. And it's so excited. So excited. There's your card back. Thank you. I like your boots. They are even better when they're on the wrong feet. Yeah. That was sugar free caramel? Yeah. And then one hot chocolate? Yeah. Okay, cool. Please, thank you. You bet. I can't, uh, warm it up a little bit. You bet. Not too hot. <laughs> not too hot, but I can't share it with my brother. Thank you. Brother. Thank you, guys. No, we're not sure. Have fun. Have it, okay? <laughs> and I wear my ducks in one hand, coffee in the other hand. <laughs> You're set. <laughs> Most important word of the day. <laughs> Every day. Okay, I'm gonna go run and grab your brother's jacket real quick. Okay? Just stand right here. Or go stand right now. I heard you have really cool boots. Can I see? Those are the coolest. My daughter would fall all over herself if she had those boots. I think you guys have the hair. Yeah. I like this. Thank you. You worked really hard on it. Did you see the ceiling? Isn't it pretty? It's actually tin, like a tin can, like a soda can. Yeah. It's aluminum. Oh, it's aluminum? Sorry, it's aluminum. No, that's tin, but cans are aluminum. Oh. <laughs> that's what I was saying. Oh. <laughs> it's made out of metal. Yeah, yeah. it's a type of metal. It's very heavy. Yeah. <laughs> was it heavy for you guys? It was. Bit. It was heavy. Did you glue it with hot glue? No, with nails. A little bit of hot glue, though, too. Oh, you did? Yeah, I used, I used liquid nail and nails. <laughs> Are you getting hot chocolate? That's awesome. I love hot chocolate. Me too. Have you ever had one of those hot chocolate bombs where you put it in and the marshmallows explode? What? We need to get some of those. Oh, that would be a good idea, actually. Put a little bit full there. It's okay. Yes, please. Okay, so I'm gonna make a little extra. Okay, I suppose. Did you sell any decaf? Nope. <laughs> you almost ran out of coffee. No, I have another. After you went in, you get that other pound out of there.
Tell me why you keep your syrups on top of your... Why are your syrups on top of your machine? Um, when it gets colder out, the syrups tend to get a little thick. They're already thick, but so it makes them hard to come out of the pump. So you keep them on there and it warms the syrups and makes them come out easier. terrible. <laughs> We're working on it. Still learning this machine a little bit. It's very powerful in the steam department. Very powerful, actually. Want to sleep? No. Thank you. Okay. No, thank you. Okay. Ready is way to go. Look. It's creamy, but not sweet. Is that what you said? Yeah. Come on. We agree. Come this way so I can stand up. <laughs> Stick your head in a little. <laughs> no, let's get over here. <laughs> okay. Wait, okay. you're supposed to do this. Oh. Arm through. Oh, like a wedding cheers. I don't think I can reach. <laughs> you know, we're drinking the same drink. She's like, I see you have some. Okay, I gotta turn on the kids. Bye. No, I have to go. Oh. I hit my head. <laughs> hey, grab the door, please. No sleeve, so that my hands are warm. And I'm going to check on the kids because they're hanging out in the car reading books. I don't usually leave them very long, but they're pretty capable of self-sustaining themselves for a short period. Nobody's screaming? No, they all were. <laughs> they were all screaming. That thing's so cute! Well, that thing's so cute. Are you ready to go? Yeah. What are you gonna get? Get some coffee? Yeah. Okay, let's go. This way. Come on. You see daddy? Go ahead, baby. Oh, that's a cool rock. <laughs> you can go. You can go. Yes. Let's go, baby. At the end of the event, teardown is simply doing everything in reverse, which if I leave my truck hooked up, it only takes me about 10 or 15 minutes. And every once in a while, I decide to do maybe dishes while I'm there, or I can wait and do it when I'm home. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you're interested in our espresso machine, click the link above for our other videos. See you next time. Ready?